What's up guys, here's another video of the iPad 2. This time I'll be going over the three new apps that are in the iPad 2. And FaceTime, obviously with my iPhone 4. So, um, as you can see there, there's FaceTime, Camera, and Photo Booth. And uh, we're going to start with Photo Booth. As you can see here, there's nine options. You got your... Uh, damn it, I forgot the names. But uh, yeah, you got nine options here. You can uh, pretty much switch between your uh, front facing camera, I got it right that time, and uh, rear facing camera. You can see there. Okay, here's X ray, yeah, I know that part. Here's the kaleidoscope, pretty cool. There's normal. Here's a light tunnel. Uh, I forgot that name. The thing was, uh, I'm not sure. Uh, and here is the uh, twirl. Pretty cool. And here is the squeeze, I believe. Or stretch, no, it was stretch. The bottom left one was uh, squeeze, I believe. And those, are, yeah. and those are the nine options. And here you can just take pictures, and I'll just post like a little thumbnail at like right above the rear facing option camera thing you can take multiple pictures it will just stay on that part you know you can take how many pictures you want it will just move to the side the pictures from what you uh, took before as you can see here so if you want to delete one of them you just tap on one of them and press the X on it and you have the option to delete it so I'm gonna do that right now in fact, I'm going to speed this up a bit, so you won't have to bear this awful the late sequence. Alright, so now we're going to go on to our second app, which is the camera. Alright, uh, right now we're on the rear view camera. Look at the table, and here's the front-facing camera, as you can see me and my horrible camera that's responsible for the stupid lightning lighting or whatever so uh, yeah the front facing camera is said to have a uh, same VGA re resolution and the rear camera is said to have uh, less than one megapixel which is kinda the same as the iPod touch fourth generation now we're gonna take a look at FaceTime and uh, this is pretty uh, cool considering it's an iPad too and pretty much has the extra space on it so you pretty much have your contacts on your right side of the screen and you can Pretty much do there's pretty much the options of what you have in the iPhone, which is like contacts, recent favorites. So now I'm calling myself using my uh, phone number, and as you can see here, uh, there I am. It's I believe connecting. Yeah, it's connecting right now. I'm gonna place it on mute because it makes a horrible echo, and I mean horrible if you don't mute it. So as you can see here, um, it kind of gets confusing, but you're gonna have to get the idea. Uh, right now my iPad is showing the rear view camera of my iPhone 4 and my iPhone 4 is pretty much uh, looking at the sorry about that I got a call and um, I don't know where I left off but I'm assuming I'm left off where I said the you know FaceTime so right here I'm showing you that you can move the little preview thumbnail uh, to all four corners I accidentally uh, disconnected uh, from my uh, FaceTime with my iPhone 4 by pressing the sleep button whoops so I'm gonna try to reconnect but besides that it's pretty cool I mean you can do whatever you want video conferencing sex call and uh, you know chatting with friends and all that other cool stuff you my teenagers or adults do but um, yeah it's pretty cool I'm saying cool a lot which is kinda getting annoying but yeah you can put in uh, landscape mode uh, portrait mode and do all sorts of stuff as far as I know um, I guess I'm using my same account yeah I'm using the same account using using one for my phone number which is the iPhone 4 and my email address which the iPad 2 is using so yeah that's pretty much it those are the three apps that are exclusive right now or not exclusive but pretty much new to the iPad 2 if you have any more questions, please post them in the comment section, and I'll post more videos up when my camera's battery is back to full. I'm sorry about that, but um, stay tuned, guys. Press the subscribe button, and I'll catch you guys later. Peace.